We were chatting briefly and you said you had some news to announce, particularly around pancreatic cancer. What can you tell us? Well, t today and tomorrow we'll be announcing at this healthcare conference that we have now, with our natural killer cell, which we've engineered, a complete response in the patient with the metastatic pancreatic cancer that had failed all other treatment. And what about another cancer that you've also been working with, uh, triple negative breast cancer? What right. are the updates there? So these are the two toughest cancers that people have had challenges with, triple negative breast cancer and metastatic pancreatic cancer. And we just announced last month in December that we have complete responses in patients who had failed every other treatment of triple negative breast cancer. And those responses have gone on for months and these patients are still alive as we speak today. So between these two cancers, triple negative breast cancer and metastatic pancreatic cancer, we're proving the theory that our work on natural killer cells and our work with natural killer cells that you and I have in our body that's born to kill is a very powerful tool for cancer. So when you say a full response, the cancer is gone. You've effectively come up with a way to treat or cure these types of cancers, am I right? Yeah, we, well, we confirmed both by, by CAT scan as well as by blood tests, the cancer is completely gone, completely eradicated from the body. And that's the news we'll be making tomorrow on metastatic pancreatic cancer. It, the cancer had spread to other parts of the body, including the liver, and after our treatment, which was very exciting after just three months, it was completely eradicated. Where are we in the battle against cancer? In our lifetime, do we think it's treatable? Do you expect it to be curable? Where are we in that fight? Well, I think for the first time, we are now understanding how we can actually defeat this, this tumor. It turns out that the most important portion to feed this tumor is your immune system. Mm -hmm. It also turns out that there are three parts of the immune system that has to be activated simultaneously. It's the three, the triangle offense, I call this. The natural killer cell of your body that is born to kill. The T cell in your body that has to be trained to kill. And then the trainer, all of us need trainers. When you put these three together, we are really close now where we can get complete responses in patients with cancer across multiple tumor types. And were you able to use that formula that you just described with the pancreatic um, cancer that you found that you were able to get a full response with on those patients? Yes. Okay. And more importantly, uh, I didn't try it just on pancreatic cancer, but we have tried it in a very dangerous skin cancer called Merkel cell cancer, complete response. A very tough cancer called head and neck cancer, complete response. Very tough cancer, triple negative breast cancer, complete response. Very tough cancer, pancreatic cancer, complete responses. And then when we added um, checkpoints for lung cancer that failed checkpoints, complete response. And then we had bladder cancer that failed all treatment, complete response. So what we're revealing for the first time now at this conference, and at what we call the Cancer Breakthrough 2020, is that we've proven this theory across multiple tumor types. How many patients are in those trials? So these were phase one, phase two trials, and they are close to over, in the lung cancer trials, over 100 patients, in the bladder cancer trial, over 200 patients. In the pancreatic cancer trials, uh, there were about 15 patients. So there were different numbers across the different tumor types. But the importance for me was to actually show that this is a common treatment protocol, a common therapy for all these tumor types, regardless of the anatomy. And the key with those three things, talking to each other, that triple attack that you were mentioning, that's different because then you're not hurting the immune system, correct? The triple attack, I call it the triangle offense. I'm a Laker. So that triangle offense is like having a guard forward in the center. All three is in your human body. Not only do we not, must not hurt them, we must activate them, educate them, mm -hmm. and educate them against the cancer. So that's what we've done. And total number of people treated in the, the pancreatic cancer and that triple negative breast cancer. So in the triple negative breast cancer, we wanted to make sure that this, this, not only this combination was safe, but actually had efficacy. So we did the first 10 patients. 
and in pancreatic cancer, the first 15. In the lung cancer, we've done about 100 patients. In the bladder cancer, we've done over 200 patients. So what we did is wanted to show to ourselves that what we have is a common treatment protocol for all cancers, which is a huge um, sort of hypothesis. What's exciting is not only we've proven we can cross these cancers, we can take these very, very late stage cancers that have metastases that people have given up on in terms of the patients and convert them to patients without any disease. Which then says now we need to actually move this early on into patients with early disease right. and most importantly execute a trial with these natural killer cells which we can now grow in an unlimited supply. And is that the next step for you? What do you go after this announcement? Well, the next step was actually announcing actually what we've done in the last three years. The concern I had was this NanQuest as a company. There's 200,000 plus lung cancer patients. Mm -hmm. How would we have enough drug or product unless you can build a scalable, what I call good manufacturing GMP facility to scale, and we're going to announce that we now successfully built that facility, and we're now building and growing trillions of cells, and we can put them into storage, cryopreserved storage, like a product, like a frozen bag, and all you do is you ship the bag, you thaw the bag, you hang it in 30 minutes, and the patient's given this as an outpatient. That is now real.